All right, so we're talking about homophones. Homophones are words that are spelled differently, but sound the same and have different meanings, right? So they're here. Let's take a look at the uh, let's take a look at this one right here. We have your, your, or by and by. Your and your sound the same, don't they, Bryn? By and by sound the same, but they have different meanings, right? They may sound the same, but they're spelled differently and they have different meanings. Let's take a look. Uh, it says, use you are or use your as a contraction of you are, right? Here it is. You're working hard today. You know how you check that? You can take the contraction apart and say, you are working hard today. Does that does that work? Yes, it does. So you know you have the right one. How about your sandwich is bigger than mine? That's the possessive to show ownership, right? Right? Your sandwich is bigger than mine. So you have your, Y-O-U apostrophe R-E, and your, Y-O-U-R. Those are homophones. Spelled differently, sound the same, have different meanings, right? How about this one? Buy and buy. Use buy when someone pays money for something. I need to buy a new pair of shoes. Or use buy to tell where something is. Fernando lives by the library. We have buy, B-U-I, and buy, B-Y. Homophones. Spelled differently, sound the same, different meanings. Yes, sir. Give me another one. What is it? Bye. Yeah, B-Y-E. B-Y-E. Bye, bye, and bye. You got it. You nailed it. That's exactly right. How about this one? Two, two, and two. All right, there's a lot of them. So let's take a look. Let's practice. It says, read the sentence. Write the correct word or words from the rule box to complete it. And the rule box is up here, right? All right. So, or maybe it isn't. Let me let me make sure where that rule box is. Yeah, it's up there. All right. So let's go. Uh, it says. Okay. It says, when I blank groceries, I look for good prices. Which version of buy do we need to put there? Right now, which version of buy? When I blank groceries, I look for good prices. Which version? That's B U I, correct? Yeah. All right, so do you guys understand what you're doing? For that part, all right, let's turn it over to page six. Ah, here we go. Homophones, some more homophones, right? So let's do this. Capture that real quick. All right, so use here when someone's ears are aware of sound. Our parents hear when we get up early or use here to describe where you are. Can you come over here? All right, so we have here, H-E-A-R, and look at look at what word is inside here for hearing, here. right? And then we have here as in a location. Here and here, homophone. Spelled differently, sounds the same, different meaning. How about where and where? Ricky will wear his new jeans to the picnic, or where are you going this week, weekend? So we have where, W-E-A-R, and where as in a location w-h-e-r-e homophones that are spelled differently but sound the same and have different meanings all right so it says read the sentence write the correct words from the rule box blank are you right now what spelling do i need to put there lily yeah which one all right do you guys know what you're doing for six all right, there you have it. Homophones. Um, good luck with your practicing. Tadero out.